good afternoon. This is RobinBremer.net is the website. And today I want to share with you about the strange noises going on in the world, all over the world today. Um, I asked God what it was and instantly I felt as though he said that the earth is groaning under the weight of sin. And, and, and that's what I feel it is. I also feel that uh, I've listened to those sounds and to me they sound like a shofar. And that is the Jewish trumpet um, that calls the Jewish people to move when they were led by a pillar of light at night and a cloud in the daytime um, to protect them. So they had automatic air conditioning and heat and they had light and so on. Um, they were led by the glory of God to move their camp and the shofar would play announcing it was time to leave, uh, to pack up and leave. Uh, or the shofar would play a uh, sound in order to, it was an alarm and different things. And um, I believe that those sounds sound like a shofar. Um, and so what God showed me, another thing is at the last trumpet, um, we will be raptured. We will rise up in the sky to meet Jesus. Those who have asked Jesus to be the Lord of their life, that's all you have to do is ask him. Lord of your life and believe in the name of Jesus um, and you'll go in the rapture and the Holy Spirit will teach you because he's your teacher, your guide, and your comforter. But I believe these strange noises are um, the earth groaning for the weight of sin because it was never created to carry sin and it just can't carry it anymore. That's why these events, earthquakes, tornadoes, tsunamis, and why this kind of stuff is happening because there's there's cracks in the earth and, and it's like a sponge where the, so much evil gets absorbed into the sponge that part of the earth is going to crack. It's just going to crack. Weakness is it's going to crack and, and stuff is going to happen. And uh, we're discovering fault lines that we never knew was there. And so, um, you know, but one thing good that I want to share with you is that this is the end time when God's spirit is poured upon all flesh. So you can expect to walk in the supernatural presence and power of God and take authority and dominion over these things. No earthquake is going to happen and you follow. No dam is going to break and you follow. Uh, no flooding is going to happen. No wind's going to come. No tornado is going to come. No destructive weather. No plague or pestilence is going to come because I live and you follow. And wherever I'm at, I'm not allowing those things to come in my territory, in my community. And that's the same thing that you're supposed to do. Uh, take authority because you rule and reign on the earth. So I just wanted to share with you a little bit about um, what God was showing me that these sounds are. Um, it's getting ready for end times. Weirder, crazier, scarier stuff is going to happen uh, than, the, than the weird sounds and, and the stars doing weird things and the solar flares. Um, there's going to be probably more sightings of UFOs um, and that kind of thing. Uh, and that's probably what's going to be blamed on a rapture. They're probably going to say that the UFOs took us. And I believe sincerely in my heart that UFOs are nothing more than fallen demons. And perhaps they're the offsprings of, in the Bible it says there were men of, of giants, of renowned giants in certain time periods. And they married women. They were fallen demons. And they married women and had offspring. And I'm believing possibly that this offspring, because they were from demons, and which are fallen angels, which are supernatural beings, that they are probably, I, I would say 99% that anything that's extraterrestrial, extraterrestrial is not a, a different... Um, alien living on a planet but it's a demon offspring or demon manifested uh, on this earth because they've been able to use a human body to recreate um, a, a flesh body or some kind of a body that has contact with earth and I believe that's what the UFO stuff is and nothing more I don't believe there's life on other planets I believe the planets are given to us man to rule and reign, not for some other life form. So um, that's what I believe about the sounds 
and the events that are taking place. Um, I believe, you know, you just need to receive Jesus and walk in his presence and his power and don't get left behind because it's going to get ugly. But now, walk in power and his presence and peace. My name is Rob Bremer. The website is .net, and I'll talk to you tomorrow.